Hello everyone, lovely to see you and thanks so much for joining this week's arranging video. I've got my cup of tea and I hope you do too. And this week's arrangement is called Sleepless in Seattle, so called because of these fiery fuego blooms are so hot, I'll be staggered if you can get to sleep. Ow. And the standout foliages and flowers in this week's arrangement, alongside the fuego blooms, rather lovely oak leaf foliage, uh, which has been painted red and is very beautiful. And a fun fact about oak leaf is that Prince Charles II once hid in an oak tree to avoid the beastly parliamentarians. Now next up, always remember your flower care. Snip an inch off the end of all your stems, use your flower food, clean room temperature water, and a nice clean vase. So to arrange this beautiful golden bunch, we're gonna start with our fuego blooms arranged evenly around the edge of the vase. And next, we're gonna face our lovely rose hips opposite each other. And what we're trying to do is create a stem grid in the middle of the vase for the other flowers to stand up in. And we're now gonna to add to the stem grid with our beautiful Alstroemeria. And what we now have is a very strong structure with all of our shorter flowers evenly around the edge. Next, we'll stand our taller LA lilies upright in the middle using this stem grid for support. And we'll then finish with our wonderful oak leaf foliage on either side of our LA lilies. The oak leaf leaves may need to be slightly pulled away from the branch in order to open them up a bit. Let it bake for a few days and your lilies and alstroemeria will pop open and look a little bit more like this. And one thing you could do is combine both of them together to make one mega arrangement in our hurricane vase. And to do this, all I'm gonna do is take my shorter flowers from both arrangements and arrange them around the edge. So my blooms, my rose hip, my alstroemeria, my oriental lilies, my solidago, and my rose hips. And then I'm gonna take my taller flowers into the middle. So my gladioli and my lilies from this arrangement and my oak leaf foliage and my carthamus and soft ruscus. And there we go, it really couldn't be easier to create one mega arrangement combining two arrangements together. So give it a go, have fun getting creative and see you next time. Thank you.